What's going on, baby boys and girls? How you guys doing? It's Uncle Muscles. I'm going to pray right now because my microphone keeps dropping. I really do appreciate everybody checking me out, though. Uh, don't forget to hit the like. Don't forget to hit the like button and the follow button and the subscribe button. Check me out twitch.tv slash Uncle Muscles. Okay? And now we're going to do the inspiration of the weapon for everyone. Okay? Thanos. We're going to Thanos this weapon so hard right now, dudes. Okay, my friends? Okay. So, okay, let's do it like this. I have a Piper, and I want to increase its effectivity, right? So, what am I going to do? I'm going to go find my Piper. And there's two ways to do this. There's actually quite a few ways to do this. You can go into town, and you can go find the leaderboard, and you can click in Spirit there. You can go find a Legend somewhere and in Spirit right on them. I think it's because the Legends do drop the runes for Inspiration. Um, you can also just click the item out of your inventory. I have this five skill unsold pipe I've just been waiting to inspire. And I, uh, in spirit, and I am going to hit more after I click that item out of my inventory. I'm going to hit more. And I'm going to hit in spirit. Bang. All right. Okay. Cool. Inspiration. Let's go. Uh, I don't like some of these abilities on the Piper, mainly the tune ability, it lo it messes me up a lot of the time whenever I try to use it. So I'm actually very comfortable with getting rid of it, especially for what I'm trying to do with my Piper. Um, the Piper, Pipa, 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 the Pipa is actually a melee weapon, go figure. Um, because all that range damage is from a melee distance, of course, so... Uh, it's a melee weapon, so what we're gonna do is actually inspirit it with melee runes. Okay, so we went into the item, we went to our inventory, we clicked in spirit, we, we clicked the item, then we hit more, then we clicked in spirit, now we're on its inspiration window, and now we're feeling like Thanos, baby. We got three stones, about to put them on our little glove, baby. Oh, we're gonna click this first button. Actually, we're gonna do the last one first, just to show you what it looks like to fill up an empty slot, and then I'm gonna replace the other skills. I want to put Radiance on my Piper. Now, I've done this before in other videos, and it didn't really make sense. And then I realized it is so awesome. It's so dang awesome. So where's, where's Radiance? Okay, cool. We're going to put Radiance on this one. That's going to be the last skill. Radiance. Let's go. Right? 30. Yep, that's the one. Let's go, babies. All right. Now, I don't like Tune. The E messes me up. When I hit E and then it, and then I try to click my left button and then I try to jump, all of a sudden the E's stuck and I can't, I'm trying, I'm triple, quadruple, quintuple tapping E and nothing comes out and I'm stuck and then I die because I'm trying to hit my inventory. I'm trying to, I'm trying to hit my potion in my inventory and I'm getting hit by a Smodbergen and then also my E, the, the E thing is still stuck on him but it's not actually getting clicked out and then none of my buttons are working. I'm banging my head against my table. And then I'm smashing my mouse into my monitor, and I'm doing a helicopter spin with my mouse. I'm doing it as fast as possible. There's smoke coming off the tip of my fingers as a pivot point as I'm just swinging and swinging and swinging. And bam, I'm hitting my monitor. And bam, I hit my monitor again. Bang, 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 bang. Now my monitor's broken because this game, because the monitor, because the game locked up, because I hit tune. And now I, now I need a refund on my monitor from Chimera Land. See, that's why I get rid of this. So now we're gonna hit. It says, please select rune here. We're going to hit that little plus button. And now I think we're going to put either subdue. Let me just double check this one. Increase attack by 30% and disappear after striking. Now, we want this to be our second... S yes, we're going to do this... This is going to be our second skill, because we're going to disappear after striking. So we're going to hit the Subdue, and then we're going to hit the Radiant. So this will be our second skill. The first skill we're going to do is the Intimidate, whatever it's called. We're going to get rid of this E ability. Subdue. Uh, uh, please be right. Please be right. Increase attack by 30, and then disappear after striking. So then the Radiance will be the Striking. I hope this should work. Hopefully, I don't mess this up. All right. Cool. I think I got that one right. And now, Strum. Strum. The Q ability on this. I actually really like the Q ability on, on the Pipa, Pipa, but I don't want it. We're going to put Inferno Strike on this, and this is going to uh, decrease our enemy's defenses. No, it's going to... 
Armor Pierce, Inferno Strike. The combo was Inferno Strike, Subdue, and then the Radiance. Now, I'm not really sure on the, the order. I think this is correct, but I can always just do it correctly with my fingers if I need to. But we're going to go Q-E-R, and I think this is correct here. So we can hit Select here on the Inferno Strike. We have the Strum selected. I believe that's Strum, right? Yep, Strum to Inferno Strike and Spirit. All right, we now have a 3K Piper. Now, I just want to show you guys what's going on. about check check yeah this is what i was talking about my microphone keeps dropping guys so i have to do some updates on my computer but i really appreciate you guys checking my youtube videos it really does mean a lot to me especially the chimera line has just been so kind to me so i really do appreciate it don't forget to check me out on twitch guys and uh like i said if you have any questions about what i'm doing uh drop them in the comment box below there'll be information about our guild and whatnot in there as well um but the reason why this inspiration came out of the original pipa video i did i made this pipa and the tardiness on it originally was 20 and that was a huge mistake because I had put Radiance on it. And so Radiance is like a really good ability, but I wasted it on this Peepa because this Peepa like would break after like zero uses. So we're redoing it now with extra, it's extra Radiancy now. Now we have the extra uh, abilities we added here, the Inferno Strike, the Subdue, and the Radiance. This should increase our damage and decrease and increase the armor pierce of the ability. This is basically increase the effectiveness of the the radiance and the pipa overall. I mean, the pipa does pipa does melee damage, so this should be very very effective now. Most people should probably be using a sword. This is a little bit of a troll build, but it just is the case that what I'm building now. Once this other pipa is done, like I uh, showed you in that last video, we're gonna pull all these skills off. We're gonna pull all these attributes off and put them on our, our the new pipa and increase that meridian power, and that's gonna be it. So that's really that was the process, guys. Hopefully. This helps you guys out in increasing your Meridian Power. The last couple videos I did are really more like the higher level, what to do with all your items, what to really, how to understand where to put your uh, materials and everything that you have in the game uh, to use. I think I'm getting Charm Bomb right now. Good time to exit. Okay, guys. I love you guys. Thank you guys for checking out the video. Don't forget to hit the like bo uh, button, uh, twitch.tv slash UncleMuscles. Sub me on YouTube. Uh, the Worst Ever Clan. Uh, Cloud C305, US Region, Worst Ever Clan, Cloud C305 Region, Twitch.tv slash Muscles. Like, follow, subscribe. You're my best friends. Love you guys. I'm out of here. Bye.